Tissue damage can occur after a serious injury or a planned surgery. And one aim of our lab is to design replacement tissues that can repair these sites of damage. We and many others in the field are applying additive manufacturing or 3D printing to design personalized biomaterials with the appropriate shape and function for repair. Our invention simplifies the design of personalized biomaterials by providing an all-purpose carrier biomaterial, or ink, for 3D printing. One approach to design personalized biomaterials is through the use of extrusion-based 3D printing, where we push a material out of a syringe to form the 3D structure. This is similar to when you squeeze toothpaste out of your tube in the morning. If it's too viscous, it won't come out of the tube. And if it's too liquidy, it won't hold on the end of your toothbrush. In 3D printing, we have the same design problem. We want to have a material that can flow like a liquid as we push it out of the syringe, but hold the structure of the 3D printed part as it exits the syringe. And to solve this problem, Alia Gutzi in his PhD research invented an all-purpose carrier ink that meets these requirements. The ink is composed of polymer chains and biodegradable nanoparticles. And in the absence of external force, these components assemble into a solid, which can maintain its shape. Furthermore, we have developed methods to incorporate secondary polymers or proteins like collagen and hyaluronic acid, allowing us to formulate a broad range of biofunctional inks. And these secondary polymers provide long-term stability for our replacement tissues. We are now exploiting our ink to design and fabricate personalized biomaterial implants, such as replacement valves for the heart or a meniscus to repair a damaged knee. In addition, we can load drugs within the nanoparticles of our ink, and we are applying this to 3D print personalized devices that can deliver drugs at the site of need locally in the body.